Hey guys, uh, welcome back to Funkos with Chris. So today is part two, I guess, of the SDCC uh, pop hunting, because I just found out that Toys R Us uh, is having some of those exclusives, like the the two Target ones, the Teen Wolf and the one from Zoolander, and they also have uh, Wong from Endgame, which is pretty cool. So that's pretty sweet. Uh, I'm hoping to pick those up, and uh, or something else. Oh yeah, Jerry from Rick and Morty and the tracksuits. That'd be pretty cool to pick up. So let's go inside Toys R Us and see what we can find. All right guys, there's Toys R Us, uh, exclusive to Canada. And yeah, uh, we'll go inside, see if we can find Jerry from Rick and Morty. And we'll also try to find Wong from Endgame. So yeah. I'll see you guys in there. Right, guys we are back in the car and yeah it was a huge success uh, very very happy what I got today uh, sorry if your stomach's a little sore and the camera was shaky hopefully you guys took some gravel before uh, watching this video and yeah sorry if the camera was shaky uh, but yeah let's get into the pops uh, very happy what I picked up today and yeah we'll start off with this one it is uh, tiny wang wait tiny wang that doesn't sound right all right guys we have tiny wong <laughs> We have Wong from uh, Avengers Endgame, really, really cool. He was also in uh, Doctor Strange and Infinity War as well. Uh, I don't remember him being in Infinity War that much. I just remember him from the beginning where he uh, was fighting Call Obsidian, I think it was, and Ebony Ma. But then, yeah, he, didn't, he just disappeared and wasn't around anymore. I can't remember what happened to him. If you do, let me know in the comments. And yeah, here's the back of the box. Uh, they don't include Rescue or the 6-inch Hulk, which is kind of odd, but uh, it probably was designed before those came out or something like that. Love the detail like on the little, like, magical rings around his hands. Really, really cool. And yeah, love the detail on his robe. And yeah, just a really, really great pop. The spring on his head is kind of high up, but like they were all like that, so couldn't really pick a good one, but really still happy to have it. Just a really great pop, so glad to have this one. And yeah, this was the biggest want of the day uh, from Rick and Morty is the tracksuit uh, Jerry. 
really, really cool pop. And yeah, uh, not a lot of detail or like anything going on with this pop. It's just him standing there with the tracksuit on. And yeah, I like the color of the tracksuit. Uh, nice and colorful. Uh, I don't know how well it's going to pick up, but there's a little heart on his, uh, over his heart pretty much. There's a better view of it. And yeah, it's really, really cool. Uh, happy to have it. Uh, finishes my Rick and Morty uh, collection again, back to 100%. So yeah, just really, really happy to have this one. Uh, here's the back of the box again. Uh, Berserker Squanchy, probably my most favorite one in the line, or in this wave right now. Uh, wish they made it like a section, so or even like a flocked one, but like, oh well, probably like in a few months they'll release that kind of version, but um, yeah, really, really happy to have that pop. So yeah, moving on to the next pop. This is not SDCC uh, related at all, but it came out a few months ago to Target, around March for Target Con, and there are no Targets in Canada, which kind of sucks. But uh, yeah, really happy to find this on the shelf. And it is the Captain Marvel uh, Target exclusive. That goes in the dark and the nice little action pose you got there. Love the detail. From the pictures I've seen online, uh, like the glow is really, 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 really well done. So I just can't wait to check it out and yeah, put my black light on it and see what it looks like. All right, guys, I'm going to try the glow on this pop. Looks pretty sweet. Shows up pretty well in person. Uh, the hair glows, the eye glows, and uh, yeah, even her hands are glowing. It's awesome. It's not picking up too well on the camera, but even like the hair there glows too. The eyes are really showing up well. I yeah, like it's awesome. Really, really cool. So yeah. There's the rest of the pops on the line. I don't have the goose with the Tesseract or even uh, Captain Marvel with a lunchbox. So that's kind of odd, but I guess that came out in March, so that kind of makes sense. But uh, yeah, here's a better look at her. Love the detail like on the mask. Really, really cool. And like the hair sticking up and like the proton or whatever they're called, proton blast, I think. Just a really awesome pop. And yeah, it's just really, really cool. I would have it and just building up that Marvel collection. So yeah, that'll uh, be it for today's video. Very quick video, very quick little pop hunt. And uh, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, spread it around, tell all your friends. Uh, if you don't have any friends, tell your enemies. Uh, but yeah, guys, uh, give this video a like, comment down below. Uh, let me know if you uh, like any of these pops or uh, currently looking for them. And yeah, subscribe too if you haven't already. And yeah, thanks so much guys for watching. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.